Hey everybody, it's Duke here in Houston, Texas. Beautiful day. We're looking at this Reflection 315 RLTS. So we're gonna take a look at it. First, let's take a quick peek at this storage. Pass through storage. You see it goes all the way through. Plenty of room for your fishing poles, lawn chairs, camping rug, whatever you got. A nice big awning here and some stereo speakers. Hey, there's a second awning, so it's got two awnings. And you notice that the windows are on the camp side. That's a desirable feature in a travel trailer. So this is the 315 RLTS. So the RL stands for rear living. TS, I'm not sure, could stand for triple side, triple slide. It's got three slides, it's got theater seating. So whichever you like better, it could be for the theater seats, but it's probably, I don't know what it is. We'll solve that mystery, I'll find out. Uh, so this one has the combination booth and table and chairs. That's kind of a cool thing that uh, Grand Design has come up with and there's storage underneath that seat right there. There's actually storage under these seats also, even though they're uh, traditional chairs, you can stash something down there. Burglars may not look there. But uh, this is a nice floor plan right here. Got that double wide sofa in the back. It makes into a, uh, it's a tri-fold sofa, so it'll make into a bed. Theater seats directly across from the uh, fireplace and TV. See that pantry over there? This is nice interior. It's very, uh, very comfortable in here. Comfortable looking, inviting. It's warm, homey. Uh, you feel right at home and it's got a nice island look at this big stainless steel sink storage underneath the island but the really thing that a lot of customers want is the uh, the windows on the campsite so uh, you're sitting at your table right here you're gonna be looking out onto your own campsite which is uh, which is a nice thing and there are tables on each side of this sofa also. Little storage areas in there. More storage up there. There's an extra counter space. There's loaded with counter space. And there is a plug up here so you can plug in your uh, instant pot, your coffee pot, whatever you got, a little toaster oven or something you like to bring. Make your favorite hors d'oeuvres. Well, Take a peek into the bathroom. It's got this uh, nice size shower. Good headroom in here. Kind of a rainfall shower head. Take a nice shower in there. And look at this comfortable position on the uh, toilet. Plenty of room, plenty of leg room, knee room. All right, so let's take a look into the bedroom here. It's pretty exciting video so far, right? Yeah, that's what I told you. And this is a king size bed. There's windows on each side of it. If you can feel a little lazy, you want to lay in bed, still nosy, you want to see what's going on with your neighbors, you can still look out there. Uh, there's a small wardrobe over here. I say small, relatively small compared to the other one. This thing is deep. It's actually pretty big. Pretty big. It's a lot of extra space right there. You got his and hers. You put all one person's clothes over here, and then the other person. It's got a huge closet. There's plenty of closet space to go around. If you're arguing about the closet space, that you know it's not right because there's so much of it. You got all these shelves. You got room for a labradoodle in here. This thing is huge. You got actually you can put your shoes, your boots, your uh, capes, all your hanging clothes, your hat boxes. Man, there's just so much room. You have to find some. You have to buy some more stuff. Bring in your travel trailer. Look at that nice wood uh, trim there on your uh, your chest of drawers there. That's where the TV goes. So uh, just wanted to give you a quick look at this floor plan. The 315. RLTS it's rear living and it is very open it's got these opposing slides the whole uh, from the refrigerator all the way to the TV that's all on a slide 
then the dining area and theater seats are on a slide so when you open it up uh, with both slides you just get a lot of space in here it's very comfortable so if you have any questions you can send me a text you can call me it's my phone number 281-467-0659 and uh, if you like this one or any of the travel trailers you see we can make a deal on one while we still have it in stock I'll disclose all the terms and conditions to you. Uh, we have a campground here with full hookups, so you can come out, uh, finalize the paperwork, bring your truck out here and hook up and uh, stay in our campground for a couple of days. If you want two or three days, doesn't matter. We'll be here to answer questions. Um, if you need any minor adjustments that you come across after you spend a couple of nights in it we'll have our staff come out and take care of you at our campground it's a great way to start out your ownership experience just any little uh little questions or concerns we can address them you don't have to call now of course once you leave you can always call me i'll treat you the same way before you purchase and after i take a lot of uh it means a lot to me to treat people the same regardless of uh, what the situation is if you bought from me six months ago a year ago i'll still treat you the same as if you're uh, somebody I'm showing a uh, trailer to right now. So thanks for viewing my video. And uh, again, here's my contact information. Uh, don't be bashful. I'll be happy to hear from you.